Investigators are trying to figure out what caused a deadly medical emergency in the Connecticut skies yesterday. They say one person is dead after a business jet headed from New Hampshire to Virginia hit severe turbulence, causing an injury to a passenger. The pilot was forced to make an emergency landing at Bradley International Airport. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Mike Cerullo has more on what experts believe may be behind this devastating incident. Turbulence. It's one reason planes can feel like they're shaking in the skies and things are getting jostled around inside. It's something many passengers here at Bradley International Airport say they've experienced while flying. I spoke to an aviation expert about how you can stay safe in the skies. Death from turbulence is extraordinarily rare. But investigators believe it's to blame for what happened Friday afternoon. Wouldn't be surprised in the least if there was blunt trauma injury as a result of being thrown around a cockpit while this passenger was unsecured. Based on what we know so far, aviation expert Michael Tiger believes the passenger wasn't wearing a seatbelt. Investigators haven't confirmed that, but Tiger says turbulence is a normal part of flying. Severe turbulence is very uncomfortable, but from a pilot point of view, it doesn't represent anything in the way of unsafe flying. The plane actually um, veered side to side. It's something Stephanie Schoen experienced firsthand on a recent flight. So people were falling on each other and it was, it was kind of scary. After this, she says she's going to be more careful in the skies. I'm going to make sure that I keep my seatbelt on even when I'm seated in the plane because that can happen very quickly. Although the plane involved in this deadly incident was a smaller business jet with only five people on board, Tiger says turbulence affects large airplanes the same way. Turbulence is a part of flying no matter what. All pilots experience turbulence, all planes experience turbulence. Tiger wants people to know that flying is safe. He says planes are built to withstand turbulence and pilots are trained to deal with it. He says passengers can take safety precautions like wearing their seatbelts. Now we are working to learn more information about exactly what happened yesterday and we'll have those details both on air and on the WFSB app. For now, at Bradley Airport, Mike Cerullo, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Mike.